Hey, what's up? So, welcome back to Sir Nicolai Kateri YouTube channel. And uh, I have some good news because um, recently um, we've just celebrated the anniversary of uh, this channel being monetized. And I'm very happy, um, you know, very grateful for the support. And um, in the past year, I've received so many messages from cat lovers, not just in the Philippines, but from all over the world. And, you know, it's... Uh, it's been really a pleasure being able to uh, to teach you guys about cats and also it's a really good thing for me to be able to share um, my love for cats, alright? So for today, we're going to be talking about cat's eyes, so taking care of cat's eyes and I'm very excited actually for today because uh, we, have a, uh, you know, we have a record number of participants in the monthly contest today and I'm so happy to actually, uh, you know, in, uh, you know, to um, to have everybody join in the contest, and so uh, for today we're going to learn something new. So wait. A All right. So like what I said, uh, we're going to be discussing uh, taking care of cats' eyes today. So this is episode 73 and what is so cool about today is that uh, we have a lot of people who joined the contest and I'm just so happy about that. Um, so anyway, so just uh, to move on because we have a lot to cover today. So let's just talk about first the content. So these are the things that we're going to be discussing today. So understanding cat's eyes, particularly about color, shapes, trivia, and how to take good care of uh, our cat's eyes. Okay. And then the second part is I'm going to be showing you about five kittens that are available on SirNicolaiCattery.com. So if you want to have a kitten that comes from me, so now is your chance. I actually have beautiful kittens that uh, I'm so excited to show you later. And then after that, uh, the third thing is that we're going to have, uh, I'm going to show you the contest for uh, you know the people who joined uh, in our uh, Cat's Eyes contest uh, this month. Alright, so there are there's a record breaking fifty-four people who joined in the in the contest today and I'm so glad uh, you know that many people joined today. Alright, so let's move on now to what we have for today. Okay. So do you guys know that uh, cats actually have the largest eyes among all mammals? And that is if you consider the head size to eyes ratio. So cats have the biggest eyes among all mammals. And I, I think um, you know there's a reason why a lot of us love cats because uh, their eyes are really just huge, right? So it's very cool to actually learn about that. And the second thing is that contrary to what a lot of us would think, cats cannot see in the dark, but they can see really, really well in the low light. Okay, I have a cat who is interrupt me, uh, interrupting me right now. Hello! Okay, so, so cats have a better uh, you know, eyesight than humans in low light, all right? Okay, and then next one is that, um, do you guys know that uh, cats only blink about one to two times per minute? So that's why when you see your cat staring at you, that's pretty normal. They don't blink, um, you know, a lot of times like humans. For humans, we need to blink uh, around 15 to 20 times actually to keep our eyes wet. But uh, for cats, you know, <laughs> just one to two times per minute. All right, and then next is that uh, cats on the average would sleep around 12 to 16 hours a day. So that's a lot of rest time for their eyes. Okay, it's pretty cool. Um, I think uh, I've talked about this before. Uh, do you guys know that all cats are actually born blind? So when kittens are born, they're actually blind. And it will take around six to seven days before the eyes will uh, function. So by the seventh to tenth day, that's when you will be able to see that the cat's eyes would be open, right? And then the color of the eyes would be cloudy blue. Alright, so it's actually very cool. Okay, so anyway, this kitty. This kitty, by the way, is Freya. Freya is going to fly to Iloilo tonight. No, oh, hi baby. Alright, <laughs> so anyway. Um, and then uh, what else? Uh, just also trivia. Do you guys know that there are eight cat eye shapes? So, you know, very cool. You have a round shape, oval shape, almond lemon walnut rounded almond uh pear shaped and hooded rounded triangle so it's very cool so maybe you guys can 
start identifying what shapes uh, your cat's eyes are okay so they're all pretty cool and then the color of the eyes will change by the sixth week of the kitten so they all start with cloudy blue color and then they will turn to another color so these are all the different colors of cat's eyes so there's a lot right so from green all the way to uh, lemon yellow all the way to copper then there are odd eyes odd eyes is like uh, having different color of eyes and then there are also some uh, color of eyes that are actually you know linked more to the species uh, to the breed of the cat so that's actually there are some unusual colors there so maybe at some point you have to be able to identify the color of your cat's eyes all right so what else uh, colors are actually based on genetics and it's about the level of uh, melanin or the pigment pigmentation that uh, you know that is in the uh, that is in the genetics of the cat it's very cool and you guys know that the most common color is yellow green right for all the cats and the rarest and I'm so happy because Lily one of my cats has this eye color and that's orange orange eyes cat the rarest among uh, you know among uh, all cats that's what uh, you know that's what the internet said Okay, so and the uh, different color of eyes are called odd eyed. So it is a condition for some cats. Uh, it's called heterochromia. Okay, and it's usually something that you see with white cats. And speaking of white cats, uh, this is probably something that I mentioned already before. White cats with blue eyes um, usually they have the tendency that the kittens or the cat, uh, you know, herself we're, we're, is going to be deaf. So maybe. You can try try to you know check if your cat is white and has blue eyes so maybe you can sort of like check if they can hear because it's actually something very interesting some people don't know that their cats are deaf okay and you might actually you know want to test so if you have a cat with blue eyes it's actually it all right okay and last uh, thing about trivia is that the cat's pupils tend to be identical so if the eyes are not identical, not color, but I mean shape-wise or condition-wise, then there is a chance that there's a health problem with cats if the uh, eyes are not identical. Okay. So speaking of uh, you know uh, cat eyes problems, so we're going to be talking actually about some problem with cat's eyes. Okay, and I think uh, this is something very important for you to know so that when you see your cats developing some symptoms about the eyes, then you can do something about that okay so i think this is my last piece of tri uh, trivia so yeah cats actually have eyelashes also and an extra eyelid so it's a third eyelid um that's under the surface of their uh you know by their eyes and it protects them from uh you know from irritation okay so there and as you probably know cats eyes would express different kind of emotions like when their eyes are very wide the eyes are going to be uh you know uh that means that the cat or kitten is very happy you know or very curious and when the pupils are dilated so that means uh you know uh, contracted i mean so pupils are contracted so that means uh, maybe the cat is angry or stressed all right so there now i'm going to be talking about uh, there's some actually eye problems that you have to be aware of because when you see these in your cat's eyes then it's time to do something Okay, so first one is let's talk about runny nose and watery eyes. It's actually pretty common because cats can develop cold, right? So in Filipino, sipon. So your cats can have cold and when your cats have cold, generally cats will just get better in less than a week. Even actually without doing anything. So cat cold is pretty normal, I think. Okay, but if the cat's uh, watery eyes and runny nose would go on beyond a week, that's when you take the cat to the vet because it could be a bigger problem that has something to do with the respiratory system okay so when the cat cold went on beyond the week take your cat to the vet because your cat might have there might be something wrong with your cat okay uh, another uh, problem that could happen with your cat's eyes is if you see that your cat's eyes are irritated glassy looking and watery eyes that means they might be allergic to something okay so the allergies could be pollen could be dust could be chemicals uh, could be smoke could be shampoo could be a lot of things 
So in that case, when your cats have allergies, so again, go to the vet. Okay. Next one is uh, if your cat's eyes are blinking, squinting, and then pawing the eyes, uh, you can see that the, your cats are trying to scratch their eyes. That is probably there's an object that is in the eyes or in the eyelid. So it might be irritating or there, must, there might be something that's blocking their uh, tear duct. Okay, so in that case, again, go to the vet. Okay. Uh, red and swollen eyes can be, uh, you know, can be conjunctivitis, and it's actually pretty common. Um, I've had actually this kind of a uh, case with uh, a few of my kittens before. So in that case, uh, when you go to the vet, uh, my vet actually prescribed the uh, ointment, which I'm going to tell you later what ointment that is, and sometimes eye drops also. Okay, so red swollen eyes, conjunctivitis. You can go to your vet so that you can get prescription, and then you will know what uh, ointment you can use. All right, next one is uh, a bit icky, so it's sticky yellow-green discharges. This would mean bacterial infection, so again, consult with the vet, okay? Uh, your vet will prescribe ointment or eye drops when that happens. Okay, and what else? Obvious pain and swelling could be glaucoma, which is usually something that older cats would suffer, all right? So if there's swelling in the eyes, go to the vet, <laughs> okay? So it's actually very funny because uh, sometimes I would get you know messages in the past you know in the past few weeks and i always tell people i am not really a vet so if there's a like health condition you know go to a vet go to a vet because the vet will probably give you better advice all right okay so now let's talk about how do you take care of your cats when your cats have uh, you know eye problems um from my personal experience actually um, kittens have more tendency to have eye problems than adults. Generally speaking, when cats uh, would uh, be vaccinated and then they're beyond four months old they're, or they're adults, usually they're very healthy and they have very little complications with eyes. Like it's very rare, I think, for me to see uh, something wrong with my adult cat's eyes. More often than not, it's usually just the morning gunk, right? So the you know, in Filipino, muta. So it's usually just a lot of dirt in the eyes. That's the only thing that usually adult cats would have. But kittens, on the other hand, because they're really just very sensitive, they can have many different kinds of irritation. And that's the reason why I have actually routine for how to take care of kittens' eyes. Okay? So this is actually what I do. I usually would, uh, you know, use cotton dipped in water, and then I would uh, wipe uh, the cotton from the corner of the eye all the way outside okay so corner outside after that you have to change the cotton okay dip again and then corner outwards okay so it's usually that's the uh, you know that's the most recommended way uh, on how to clean your cat's eyes so use different cotton for each eye don't touch the eyeballs it should just be on the outer eyelid and then of course uh, moving away Okay, so that's uh, usually the best thing to do. So you might want to ask, but is it possible to actually use cleanser or like uh, any other, um, you know, equipment? Um, maybe just double check if they're safe for cats. Okay, so the recommendation is that don't use anything you're not sure of. Okay, particularly with some uh, eye wipes or like, you know, etc. They might not always be safe for kittens. So just be careful. When that happens all right so actually these are some of the products that i use for cleaning my cat's eyes so i have here um these are cotton rounds so basically uh you know cotton uh uh that that's pretty easy you know to actually use um some people use it to remove makeup i use it actually for my cats so this one easy to dab uh with water and then easy to you know clean your eyes uh, the eyes of your cats with and the other product i have is this one this is a, a pooch eye doctor eye cleanser okay pooch sorry doctor pooch eye doctor eye cleanser right doctor pooch eye doctor eye cleanser right okay so it's an eye cleanser okay so this is uh, what i use okay but actually um i just uh recently discovered this I also use NutriVet eye cleanser, which uh, was recommended to my uh, by my vet 
um, you know, for a few months now. But they ran out of it. So that's why I was using the uh, Dr. Pooch, um, you know, thing. And then in, in very, you know, in very grave cases of eyes, like if the discharge is really heavy and that the eyes are really just, you know, um, doesn't look, uh, doesn't look nice. Um, my vet actually recommends this uh, ointment. So this is the uh, Tricin. So Tricin ointment. Um, how much is it? Around 500 pesos, 600 pesos. Right, so this one is uh, something you can find on Lazada or Shopee. Well, this one, the eye doctor eye cleanser, is around three hundred pesos. Right, so three hundred pesos. The NutriVet is a bit more expensive. I think it's around five hundred pesos. Okay, so these are the major products I use for for cat eyes. Uh, so if you're a breeder, I think this is going to help you a lot because from what I said, you know, majority of the time. The kittens are the ones who have, you know, eyes that are sometimes unstable, etc. Okay, so this is why if you see pictures of breeders, uh, kittens, and the eyes look a bit not as clean as you want them to be, uh, I would recommend, you know, just be more understanding because it's really difficult sometimes for the breeders um, to actually, uh, you know, have that the eyes are already healthy immediately. Okay, usually these kind of things happen. But don't worry. Usually by the time that you get your kitten, you know, by the third and a half month or fourth month, usually the eyes are perfect already around that time. All right. Okay, so that's actually uh, already it. Um, and then one final thing uh, for me to maybe uh, end this uh, lecture part of uh, our today's uh, um, live stream is that uh, there are some vitamins that are actually great for the eyes. Okay, so there's LC-VIT. LC-VIT is uh, basically uh, with lysine, so which is uh, fantastic for the eyes. Okay, the mineral is fantastic for the eyes. And then for my international audience, so I actually put here two products from Amazon.com that you guys can uh, buy. So that's, there's Eye Health Complex. Okay, so I think it's tablet, uh, if I'm not mistaken. And the other one is uh, lysine immune support. Okay, also tablets, I think. Okay, so you might want to get these so that your cat's eyes will be healthy, um, you know, uh, even for kittens and adults. All right? So that's basically it for the first part of our live stream today. So we're now going to proceed to the, you know, to uh, the second part of this live stream. And I'm going to just show you some adorable kittens that I offer just in case you're interested to get kittens for yourself. So anyway, um, the kittens that come from my cattery have TICA pedigree certificate and TICA stands for the International Cat Association. And I gave also my personal uh, Cernicoli cattery adoption certificate so that you get to be reminded of all the details of your cats, like who are the parents of your cats, and then uh, basically what diet your cat is uh, on, if you're going to get from me. Uh, I also gave vet passport with complete vaccinations already, anti-rabies, uh, deworming, etc. I give pet crate, which is actually more of a bag, and then sampler food. Okay. Usually the kit is, uh, the kitties that you know that come from my cat are very sociable, very sweet because. I play with my cats and they're sociable with other cats also. All right. So at this point, uh, let me show you some of the kittens. Let's start with. So I, I'm my cattery now is actually with litter S, T, and U. So I actually, you know, when I started my cattery business, I started with litter A, okay, and then litter B, etc. And I'm now at lit litter S, T, and U. So this is why the name of uh, the kittens that you will find today are. S, T, and U. Okay, so let's start with letter S. So this is Shamin, guys. Uh, Shamin is a beautiful Scottish straight female. If you want to get her, go! She's three months old. She's very sweet. Um, she is calico. So when we talk about calico cats, um, you know, they have three colors on their fur. Okay, and she's uh, this kitten is actually very interesting because uh, it's like she's between short hair and long hair. So it's sort of, sort of like... Uh, short hair but a bit fluffier than short hair so let me just show you so this is her back so when you look at her back you know it's calico because there are three colors so there's black there's white and then there's also cream because her mother is uh, uh, Fifi who's also cream colored cat bicolor cat 
but in her case, Shamin is a no, tricolor cat. She's available for 50k, 50,000 pesos. So if you're interested to get, go get her because uh, Shamin is very beautiful. And she's ready to be released in about two weeks. So you can get her uh, by mid October. All right. Okay, this one is Torchic. Look how cute Torchic is. She's a British. He, he is a British long hair kitten, 2.5 months old. Uh, this is what we call golden shaded color. Um, a bit closer to ginger, but a bit different. Um, to be honest, these kind of cats can actually be around 100,000 pesos abroad if you import them from abroad, all the way to 200,000 pesos. But I'm offering Torchic only for 70k. So just in case you're interested to get, uh, you know, uh, uh, British long hair, golden shaded, 70k. It's actually pretty cheap already. Okay. And I have another kitten who's also golden shaded. Um, this one is uh, a bit a bit more in the brown side, but this is still called golden shaded NY25. That's a code actually for European cats. So it's not as ginger looking or uh, orangey as uh, a store chick. Um, so this one's a bit more bronze uh, looking, but still golden shaded. So a bit uh, lower price, so 65K. So Torchic was uh, 70K, okay? This kitten is very sweet. So if you want to get a sweet kitten, Trico. Trico is very sweet. Okay, let's now go to the British short hairs. I have two British short hairs to show you. This is Umbreon and Umbreon. So we're now at letter U. Uh, Umbreon is a British short hair. And look at how, uh, you know, how beautiful her eyes are. So really, really beautiful. And yeah, she's 2.5 months old. And she will be ready for release along with Torch and Trico by end of October. Alright, so end of October. So there. And uh, Umbreon is uh, very beautiful. Look how playful she is. Right? So she's available for 55K. Okay. And the last one that I want to show you is Yuxi. So Yuxi is uh, 2.5 months old. And the special thing about her is her blue eyes, which are actually beautiful for silver shaded. Okay. Take note, this is not white. So not white, no danger of a kitten being there for anything this is gold uh, you know silver shaded so some parts of her coat are actually you know black and white so it's very cool so there uh, blue eyes uh, she had a lot of gunk <laughs> under her eyes and I took these pictures I just uh, you know removed them but you can still see that she has beautiful eyes so when the gunk is very clear the tear stain would be clear you can just imagine how beautiful this kitten is and she's available for 60k Alright, so those are the five kittens. Um, anyway, so if you want to reserve a kitten, uh, they're already posted on my website, sernicolaikateri.com. Um, actually, in the past few days, I already uh, uh, made my website accessible by typing sernicolai.com. So if you want to type something shorter, sernicolai.com, it will lead you to my website, sernicolaikateri.com. So there, you can message me directly on... Uh, you know, uh, using that uh, website or on my Facebook page or you can message me on Twitter, on Instagram or you can email me, okay? So I'm so sorry, by the way, this is only for uh, for uh, for people in the Philippines. I don't ship my kittens abroad yet, okay? Because I get anxious, you know, how my kittens are, you know, when I ship them to clients. So this is just for, for local uh, shipping, local adoption. All right, but I do ship actually in, in in the provinces. Like what I told you a while ago, uh, the kitten that I was holding, Freya, she's actually flying to Iloilo tomorrow morning. So it's pretty cool. Okay, and I've shipped actually just a few days ago to where was that? Puerto Princesa. Yeah. So the, I had a client last week, and the kitten actually flew to uh, Palawan. Cool, right? And then just a few. Uh, months ago, I had kittens who went to Zamboanga. So, uh, sorry, not Zamb yeah, Zamboanga, also Davao, and CBO. Very cool. Alright, so if you're interested, um, and probably you already know this, that I'm giving actually additional 5,000 pesos discount from the base price to those of you who would want. So, this promise until end of 2021. Alright, so just in case you want to get kittens, and if you are subscribed to my channel, you can get that additional 5K discount and people have already availed that so that's why if you want to get a kitten there so it's fantastic just right there in the reservation form that you are a subscriber of a Sir Nikolai Kateri YouTube channel 
Okay, so, and that's it. That's actually what we have for the second part. We're now going to move to the third part, which is actually crazy because there are 54 people who joined. <laughs> so, that's a lot. And because I am so happy that, you know, we've celebrated my anniversary of uh, being monetized, this YouTube channel, and there are many people who joined. So, I'm happy to announce that we're going to have three prizes today. So, in the past few months, you only have two prizes, right? So, my pick and then the raffle winner. But this time around, this is what we're going to do. So, the main raffle winner will still win 40 pieces, okay? My personal pick is still going to win 20 pieces. But there's going to be a second raffle winner, 20 pieces, okay? So, overall... Um, 80 pieces of chow churu will be won today right so it's you know i i feel like being generous because we also have uh, we, we've also hit 8k subscribers thank you so much so sir nicole Cattery youtube channel now has 8k subscribers and i, I thought of giving 80 uh, chow churu because you know i'm a <laughs> i am actually into numbers so it's just fun <coughs> excuse me all right, so let's look. Let's look now at the pictures. So I'm so excited. And these are actually so many. So I'm just going to move my camera just a bit because the text that I'm reading is going to be here. All right. Okay, so let's look at the different uh, pictures that, uh, that you guys have submitted. Okay, there. The first one is from Diana Nicole. Diana Nicole, oh, cute. So this is Bon. Our Bon's eyes are so expressive. Do you know when he's annoyed, even though it was his first birthday? Yeah, happy birthday, Bon. Uh, a bit sad, seeking for attention, just very sleepy. Okay, Bon is very cute. Okay, thank you, Diana. Next, we have from Roger. My bugoy sky staring at me with that face. Haha. <laughs> so, very cute. Thank you for sharing bugoy uh, sky's picture. Roger, thank you. Next, we have Gabby. I spy with my little marble eyes. Okay, word play on the, the word I. Okay, looks very cute. Also sleeping by the keyboard. Okay, very cute. Thank you, Gabby. And of course, we have our regular, you know, uh, contest uh, uh, participant, uh, Foxy from Janine. I'm the king of this house. This carton is my throne. Makuha ka sa tingin. That is probably something that I can't translate into English. Makuha ka sa tingin. I can't translate that into English. It's 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 very different to translate to English. But anyway, next. Uh, thank you, Janine, for that picture, Foxy. Next. Uh, this is Cedric's uh, kitten, a uh, cat. Eye on the prize. Very cute. Golden eyes. Next, you have uh, from Twitter, Raspberry. Happy weekend from this cat. Very cute eyes. Blue eyes. Thank you, Rasper, for sharing that. Uh, next, we have two pictures from Dear John 26. Winter, before you look at me, take away the, the dirt in your eyes. <laughs> All right, so it's very cute. Uh, and then the second one is that, do you see a lizard, Mau Mau? Uh, very cute. So different colors of eyes, okay. Oh, uh, winter has very bizarre color of eyes. Or maybe it's because of the filter of uh, the phone thank you dear john for sharing those pictures next we have from doi shio's eyes appear to be blue at first then turn green when she got a bit older cool so this is uh, what i was uh, saying before you know the cat's eyes actually change usually around six sixth week um then the eyes uh, color will change then we have a wow beautiful photo from anna therese rd no blinking my entry for Sir Nicolai's monthly contest featuring my Persian cat, Catlass. <laughs> this is him during playtime, making eye contact, is expressing his utmost love. Or utter annoyance, I will never know. Hoping he wins his favorite Chow Churu treats. Look at the... Oh, very cute kitten. Thank you, Anna Therese, for joining. Okay, next one is from Jasper Lintag. Hello, I'm Salem. Ooh, very, very cute eyes. Thank you. Uh, next, from MAG. Uh, the eyes that I fell in love with, I really love it when they stare at me intently while mew meowing. When they're hungry and asking for food. I love it when their eyes are asking for cuddles and when they're sleepy. 
Oh, very cute. These are three cats, I think. Yeah, very different cats. Okay, thank you, M-A-G. Next is from We the Kitties. We the Kitties. Uh, here's Weepy by our window, amazed at the little birds flying around. Yeah, cats love just looking outside, watching, uh, you know, uh, birds. Uh, I think uh, Cat Daddy... What's his name? I'm so sorry. <laughs> cat Daddy actually also, you know, calls this uh, the Cat TV, right? Um, okay, so I'm getting brain fart right now. Cat Daddy. You guys know who he is. All right, so this is what they call the Cat TV, okay? And then we have Lawrence uh, also with Foxy. Why are you so handsome, Foxy? Smize. Meowdy is so proud of you. Very cute. Also, orange eyes. Orange eyes, rare color for cats. Thank you, Lawrence. Okay, then we have three pictures from Shin Pusa. And uh, what do you mean no more Chow Churu? <laughs> so different emotions from uh, from this cat. Thank you, Shin Pusa. Next one is from Wena Capistrano. Show you, a.k.a. Choi Choi, a.k.a. Chonky Boy, uh, resting after playing Habulan with me. Very cute. Thank you. Next is Janeline Piao. My beautiful lilac girl, Nana. Eyes like gold. Ooh, very cute eyes. Okay, thank you. And then we have Meow Meow Toast. Uh, two pictures from Pearl to Baba Pearl. Oh, so same cat but different, uh, you know, dilation of eyes. Okay, very nice. Thank you, Meow Meow Toast. Next, we have Marco Bautista showing us a uh, cat with blue eyes. Can I spend all my nine lives with you, Tonyo? Oh, very cute. Then another blue. Oh, I, I think it's more of like a camera effect on the eyes from Pusspin 5. It's almost Halloween. Yeah, very creepy. Spoiled rescued cat. Very cute. Thank you, Pusspin 5. Next is from SP Fam Meow. I can see my and our high our house's reflection in Seri's eyes. Right, yeah, you can. From the reflection in the eyes. Very cool. As if she's saying they're all mine. <laughs> Alright. Thank you, SP Fam. Next, you have a former winner, Okasa Neko. In a cat's eye, all things below to the cat. Uh, oh, they're very related, these two pictures. All right, so thank you, Pinky, for showing us Sky Flakes. Next one is Sababa Cat. Sababa Cat is my cuddle me face versus where's my food face. Very cute. All right, okay, thank you, Sababa Cat. Next one also, four pictures from Mia Camille. So the first one is uh, we're joining Sir Nicolai Catfish Cat's Eye Contest. This is Cookie, very cute black and white cat. Thank you for uh, showing Cookie with us. And this is my brother, Wafer's entry. Thank you for this contest. All right. Thank you also for joining, Mia Camille. All right. Next one is Sundays with Tofu. Okay. Tofu has such expressive eyes and it shifts quite a lot in different situations. Big and round that can hold galaxies when it's curious and wants to play. Icy blue against the brightness of the sun. Sometimes you want to pretend that he can understand what you're telling him even if he's deaf. Oh, just because he looks at you so intently. Happy weekend from Tofu and I hope somebody looks at you the way Tofu does when he wants a treat. This is an entry for a giveaway. All right. Thank you so much, uh, Sundays with Tofu, for showing us Tofu. It's so adorable. Thank you. Next is from Cha De La Rosa. Everyday look. <laughs> Very cute. Almost like cross-eyed. Then we have a uh, uh, hairless cat from Mississippi, Massachusetts. Food, food, food. She's just trying to give me her magic trance for more food. Very cute. Thank you so much, Mississippi, Massachusetts. Next, we have a lot of cats from you, Catos. Uh, oh, maybe, oh yeah, they're different cats. And one cat, the middle cat, is odd-eyed. So very cute, and uh, from what I remember, it's not here in the you know uh, in the slide. Uh, they just have hit uh, a number of followers. Uh, congratulations for the number of your followers in your Instagram. Very good. Uh, good job, you catos. Very cute cats. Okay, next one is from James Chugwig. Oh, very cute. Still, even if you have one eye, my meow me says I have a perfectly handsome eye. Yes, you're very handsome. 
right? Thank you, uh, James Chugwick, for showing this. Next, we have a uh, Tigreal Snow. Look at our eyes. Dirty, eh? Someone looks so Asian here. <laughs> we wear in polos because it's uh, my third and Tigreal sixth month today. Snow. Ah, cool. So, Tigreal and Snow. Very cute costumes. Thank you for sharing, Tigreal Snow. Then we have Justin, uh, Justin Hieronimo. Uh, very cute uh, kitten. Thank you for showing us. Next one are two pictures from MyTL01. Kali series of grumpy eyes and face. Even if I'm so sorry, I, I forgot to, uh, to uh, you know to click that that more link. Okay, but uh, yeah, Kali's eyes are very intense. Thank you for sharing, my deal. Oh one. Okay, next one is Kit Kat V O eighteen. Kit Kat watching me while working. Very cute. Meow me. Let's play after work, please. Give me some belly rub. Oh, very cute. Thank you for sharing Kit Kat with us. Next, we have that cat, Jones M. Our Preggy, our, oh, sorry, our Peggy knows how to give us a meow del look. Meow del look. Okay, she has a perfect projection of her golden eyes. Thank you so much, that cat. Next, we have a sharing of, from four cats and a cam. Look into my eyes, Chapo. Very cute. Okay, very cool picture. Thank you for cats in a cam. Next, we have Papi on the loose. Um, a perfect stare that I know he demands for treats. Very good. Thank you, Papi, for joining again. Next, we have Suyoji. He's staring at the lizard again. <laughs> right. Cats usually just stare uh, randomly at some wall. Okay. Very cool. Next, we have Jun Lumawan. Jun Lumawan uh, joined uh, actually in both uh, Facebook and uh, this is Instagram also. Aura muna while waiting for food. So, just uh, basically uh, trying to be cute. Okay, Pepper with her majestic eyes, just snow snowshoe Siamese. And Kiefer, taking his monthly trimming of his claws, though his eyes seem like seeking for help. So, thank you for sharing your three cats with us, June. Thank you so much. Hope you win. Next, we have Je Gelai, 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 not perfect. Oh, that's a macro photography for you guys. So, cool eye photos. Nice. Okay, and then we have, uh, you know, oh, <laughs> very cute kitten. Magbiro ka na sa lasing wala sa bagong gising. Another Filipino statement that's so hard to translate in English. Um, you can joke with someone who's intoxicated, but not with someone who just woke up. It doesn't have the same kind of magic, you know, with Filipino. Okay. Anyway, so thank you, um, Jelai, for uh, sharing those two pictures. Next, we have Sess, ADQ, Meowdel. Yeah, very cute. Thank you for sharing. Uh, we have Shiro, the Persian cat. My mom always likes snuggles and selfies. I look at her with my hazel eyes and it gets her every single time. <laughs> Maybe Shiro, uh, Shiro gets treats because of those eyes. Thank you for sharing, Shiro, with us. Okay, we're now down to our last set of uh, pictures. This uh, from Facebook, all of these. We have from Dre Cortez. I may have a vile attitude that can devour your soul, but my eyes always betray that aura I am trying to pro project. Very cute cat <laughs> with, the, you know, with the plants. The innocence in me always shines through my uh, when my eyes... Uh, starts to glow and there you are and raptured with the cuteness i bestow wow there's some poetry here you cannot see me that's for sure i'm hiding in these flora so i can escape from you go away you babbling fool i'm a beastly cat and not a kitten anymore very cute thank you for sharing your verses with us Dre. next up we have jj uh and then uh, when i look at your eyes i don't see a cat i see a friend and i feel a soul very cute cat thank you jj Okay, next one's from Jiomi and Abrea. Cute, very cute cat. Thank you. Then we have Pucci, cat care, my little sunshine, Sandy. Secret lang, malapit na siyang tanggalan ng santol. Oh, so this cat is going to be neutered. Alright, so that's the hidden message there. Alright, thank you for sharing that. Then we have Cindy Address. Oh, a lot of photos of this. So let me try to translate this into English. From the cat's uh, appearance, 
uh, this kitty looks like an addict. Uh, you know, sabog na po siya. Addict, uh, oh my god, the translations for the, for today's uh, episode is very hard. Um, and, oh, okay, but they're addicted to her beauty, right? And her eyes are communicating, uh, you know, and this uh, cat's name is Celine. Okay, very cool. Thank you, Cindy. Then we have uh, Bingel Villarama, and the cat's name is AstraZeneca. <laughs> Seriously? You name your cat after vaccination? Yeah, okay, you do you. Okay, very cute cat, uh, Bingel. All right, the next one you have Cherry Forma. Uh, this little boy here is very expressive. I'm very happy seeing Cody's eyes like this from having thick mucus and fairy eyes to big and healthy eyes, real quick. Such a fighter. Yeah. So, yeah, when you look at the eyes uh, at the bottom part of the photo, a lot of mucus. Yeah, that happens with kittens. And right now, you know, um, Cody looks very healthy. Okay. Thank you, Che, for. Uh, sharing this okay very cute code is very cute then we have marianne from Mac uh, macavinta hello everyone my name is percy i'm the greatest gift my family have ever received much love everyone very good oh look uh, she uh, he has uh, eyeglasses very cool all right thank you marianne for sharing okay next we have princess mendoza onyo the universe in the cat's eyes yeah very cool thank you then candy Maggie and Loki's beautiful eyes. Ooh, very cute. So, thank you for sharing the staring eyes. Um, we have uh, Chaldean Makasero Go. Cute but psycho but cute. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, I agree. Very cute. Then we have uh, from Hil Mercolita. Her eyes are as beautiful as a paradise. It entails peace and harmony. Yes, very peaceful picture. Very beautiful. Thank you, Hil. Then we have from Cherry Ponce with Zoe Cutie. Thank you. Very cute. And this is the last one for today from Bell Bukat. My Yungi. Yungi is very cute. Thank you for sharing these uh, photos with us, Bell. All right. So that's actually what we have for today. So um, before I announce uh, my personal pick for uh, this month's uh, uh, contest. Okay. So let me announce uh, next month's contest. October, which is actually my birth. Uh, month okay so it's my birthday in a few days actually so yeah so it's all about celebration so i want to see cats eating cat food all right so let's just see a lot of cats eating food so i think that will be amazing okay so our live stream will be on the very last day of october because that's the last sunday of the month okay so that's a lot of time for you guys to think about take pictures of your cats all right so to join uh just post a picture uh, or a picture essay about the theme and then you can post it on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Okay, if you're going to uh, uh, join via uh, Instagram and Twitter, you can use hashtag Sir Nikolai Kateri so that you can join. Okay, but if you're on Facebook, very important, the hashtag must be Sir Nikolai Kateri October. Okay, because Facebook hashtags are very bizarre. So that's why we have a different hashtag for joining if you're on Facebook. Another very important thing, your post must be public mode. Your account must also be public mode, okay? So that's why I, I, I think uh, someone messaged me last month and I had to tell that person that the person's Twitter account is private. So if the Twitter account is private, I will not be able to see the, you know, the entry, all right? So it has to be public account. I think same goes also for Instagram, okay? So if you want to join, I'm so sorry, but you have to make your... Uh, your uh, profile public okay so that i can see your pictures okay so that's pretty much it and so i'm going to announce right now the winner of september's best post cat's eyes will win 20 pieces of chow churu right okay so so who do you think i won okay so i just hope that of course uh by the way <coughs> Sorry, the winner has to be in the Philippines because I need to send it via Grab or via LBC. So, sorry to my international viewers, but uh, contest just for Filipinos uh, or anybody in the Philippines. Okay, so anyway, September's best post in my personal opinion. So, this is my bias, but don't worry. I still have 60 chow uh, churu to give. 
But my personal pick for this month is congratulations, Anna Therese. I love this picture. This is a very beautiful picture in my personal opinion. Congratulations, Anna Therese. You won 20 pieces of Chow Churu. I will be messaging you on, uh, what's this? I, I think Instagram. Uh, oh, no, no. I think this is Twitter. So I'll be messaging you on Twitter on how to claim your prize. Congratulations, but you can still win in the free practices. We're now going to do the the official raffle. All right. So first is going to be 20 pieces of Chow Churu. Okay. So this is our second place for this raffle. Okay, and the winner of 20 pieces of Chow Churu is going to be Mississippi again. So congratulations, you won. Okay, so yeah, like what I told you, practice winners can actually win again. So Mississippi, Massachusetts, I'm going to message you how to claim your prize. Okay, 20 pieces of Chow Churu for you. Okay, so let me just take a screenshot so that I don't forget. Okay, so close, uh, clear winners. And we have 40 pieces of Chow Churu, okay? But this time around, Mississippi, Massachusetts, I'm so sorry. If you win again, you cannot get. You can get the 40 pieces, but, you know, uh, we'll have to draw again for the 20 pieces. You can't win both, okay? So anyway, so the winner of 40 pieces Chow Churu today is going to be... Star Raffle... Yukatos! Oh my God, congratulations, Yukatos. Your three cats won... The 40 pieces Chow Churu. Congratulations. And I will be messaging you, you Katos, and uh, Mississippi, Massachusetts on how to claim your prizes. Alright? Okay. So that's it for our live stream today. Thank you so much for uh, joining. And uh, next month, uh, we're going to be uh, discussing about cat food again. Okay? So I'm not sure exactly how to go about it but i will plan something because like what i said you know uh, october is very special for me because it's my birth month and so yeah that's uh going to be uh let's just celebrate you know um by actually just uh you know uh, just posting pictures of cats eating and i think that would be amazing all right so thank you so much for joining uh, if you haven't subscribed please subscribe and uh if you uh you know if you want to join please just join even if you've won you can also join We'll be doing the contest until end of this year. So we still have three more months, uh, you know, with Chow Churu. All right? Uh, with the contest with Chow Churu. Thank you so much. Stay safe. Uh, please get your vaccination so that everything will go back to normal. And to those in the Philippines, please register for vote uh, for elections next year. So that will be very important for all of us. And I hope all, all of you guys will be safe. All right? Thank you all so much. Bye-bye.